Hello ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. I am Dres Regulus, the one and only king of the dragons, and today it's that time of the month, man. It's that time, it's that time. Time for another monthly, a monthly kind of video of what the school I just got. Um again I'm trying to do these more consistently and it it's probably gonna be more consistent, especially since I'm not playing fighters that much anymore. Uh uh or doing the or was doing videos as, as, with fighters as much but probably i'm still going to be doing fighters video probably the next video is actually going to be probably a fighters video but that's besides the point i digress uh by the time you guys are seeing this is probably going to be uh after christmas so for those who uh who did celebrate who did who does celebrate christmas happy happy christmas uh, uh merry christmas and uh happy holidays uh, I hope you guys had some great food. I hope you guys had spent some time with some great family time, family quality time, and things like that. Okay. So, with that being said, uh, I think it's time for us to get into it. Right? Let's, let's get into it. So the first thing I really want to uh, address and show is probably the clothes section. So, uh, this is the first thing. I think the first thing I got in a in a while is going to be the Hypeland hoodie. It's going to be the Hypeland hoodie for uh, Yu Yu Hakusho. This is the front and that's the base of the back. Uh, really, really like the print on this. It feels very comfortable as well. And it feels amazing. This is probably the best hoodie I have as of right now. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm trying to get better clothes and stuff like that. I'm probably going to get another hoodie. Not from Hypeland, but from from another company and stuff like that that they said that have good renew reviews but i'll show that probably next time if i do but yeah so the hype lane hoodie and not only that i decided to get one more from the yu yu hakusho one more one more clothing piece from the yu yu hakusho is going to be the karama shirt uh the the eye karama eyes olive shirt uh this is the song this is the um shirt that i wanted to get because of the shoot one of the shoes that i did get in this one i know it's a little bit like uh it's a little bit um what is it uh it's not iron uh these are actually about to go in the um go in the uh the washer excuse me i just can't talk right now i just got off of work uh i worked on this by the side by the time you've seen this again it's gonna be after christmas but i did record this before christmas uh so i worked that whole day i've been working like literally the last three days in a row uh all opening shifts so it's been crazy it's been it's been really crazy man it's been really crazy so with that being said uh let's get on to the actual model kits because i did get two two more model kits so give me one sec so it's the first one is the one that i got earlier on in the month and it's the one that i have been i have yet i am yet to build uh this is going to be the rx rx 93 new gundam real grade kit so I have not yet uh, built this yet, but I know that this is going to be a wonderful get and kit, and I can't wait to get my hands on it. But the reason why I haven't actually used or actually like uh, built this one is because I've been building another one, actually, uh, and I'm sure that later. It's a uh, it's a kind of continuation, but yeah. From what I know, this kit is really great. It's one of the best uh, real great kits that uh, are out. If you do like Gundam and things like that, it's one of the best real great real great kits you can get. So I'm very excited to have this on my on my on my shelves in the in this in this glass case right over here. This glass case. Uh, with that being said, there is the one that actually outshines it. Really, it's going to be. This one actually comes from Japan. Uh, this is the one that this is one that I had to get shipped over and I had to wait a, a while ago, a while in order to be able to actually get this kit because you cannot get it in the US. Uh, fun fact, you cannot get this one in the US. You have to get it shipped from Japan somehow, even either through Amazon or through another means. But it's going to be the Master Grade Maneuver Striker Pack or uh, the Eclipse Gundam. Uh, so this is what I have been building. This is what I have built and stuff like that. It's still not done, but it's all, it's almost there. But I do have it on the Gundam. I, actually, better yet, let me just let me just grab it right now. Actually, all right. So this is what it looks like. This is the uh, Master Grade version with the Maneuver Striker Pack. Uh, so I I am loving this Gundam. I, I love how it looks. I love the poses with it. It feels a lot more like full 
it feels like this is a full this is the full thing of the kit this is how it was supposed to look like and things like that i love it i absolutely love it i'll probably show some um some panels of what it looks like without the, the lighting and stuff like that because the lighting is supposed to be specific towards me so with the better lighting and things like that but it looks amazing and it looks absolutely insane i i love it i love it i really do this is this is a hundred percent hands down my favorite model kit that i have in my collection a hundred percent a hundred percent hands down this it, it, it's it's just great it's just great man and i have it on this uh, on this shelf over here so i'm gonna go ahead and put it back now the next thing i have is something that actually uh flows uh very dear to my heart it, it's very it's very dear it holds a lot of memories of uh shows that i've watched and uh yeah so um the, the one thing that i did get that i had to get after i heard the un unfortunate news give me one sec so the thing that i did get was the lord of power rangers lord dragon replica helmet uh i got there it was it was at it was at my job gamestop that i saw and i had to get it i had to get it if you guys are not aware uh, the White Ranger, or the White Ranger, or some also may know as the Black Ranger and the Green Ranger as well from Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, uh, has passed away, unfortunately. Um, I don't remember 100% what happened. I'm, I, last time I checked, it was from, um, um, he unfortunately ended his own life, unfortunately. Um, it was just close to show that you never know what someone's going through, no matter, like, no matter what at what stage of their life because last time i last time i remember seeing him on anything on any type of social media was the was TikTok, uh or i think i think at twitter i think on twitter also and uh, he showed like his collects his uh green morpher kind of thing that they used um in the filming and stuff like that so i had to get it because of how how important power rangers really uh really is in, in like in my life how, how it has it is probably like the one show that i still sometimes keep track of myself because i just like power Rangers. it was always it's always something that i did it's it's something that i always liked and he show he showed up at the black ranger in my favorite in my favorite iteration of power rangers dino thunder uh so i i felt like i, I wanted definitely to get give me one i need, definitely need one i'm probably going to also get a shirt as well uh from him but this is this was a must this was a must now lord draken in the comics if you guys don't know lord draken is basically the evil version of the, of what tommy would have been essentially uh if he stayed with rita after the whole thing but yeah the new, this was something i had to get i had to get this so yeah this will be this was this is actually as a replica and it has a stand that i'm going to put it back up after all this but yeah Dude, rest in peace uh uh jason man Rest in peace, Jason. Rest in peace, Tommy. Now, the last couple things are actually shoes, all right? The last couple things are actually shoes. These are things that I did get um, that, well, one of these, the ones that I'm about to, the one that I'm about to show you right now, is something that I got uh, from a coworker. A coworker gave me, I don't celebrate Christmas. For those who don't know, I actually don't celebrate Christmas, but uh, my girlfriend does and some other people that I do know in my family does. Uh, but me, my mom, and my dad, we don't actively celebrate Christmas. But with that being said, um, that's beside the point. My coworker decided to give me a gift anyway because of helping him out on one day, uh, which goes to show, hey, just be a good person, man. Just, just, just be a good person. Honestly, just be a good person. It, it, and then things will come back to you. It will, it, will, it will definitely find a way back to you if you just, and that's just what something I believe. I believe that everyone should be a good person if you if you are good and and if you are just stay to your morals and then everything everything will flow to you that, that's just what i believe okay that's just what i believe uh but again i i was helping him out one day and so he just gave me some uh some bands so he gave me some bands some uh some of the red the, the flame bands the red flame bands uh the flame things like that but these are pretty nice it's not bad Looks a little something. I appreciate it a lot. I appreciate it so much. Even if it's just a, something very small or something like that. A, a, anything anybody gives me, I appreciate so much of the plus. And that's why I appreciate you guys, you guys as well, for just coming, coming over and checking it out, checking out my channel. I, I really do. I appreciate it so much. 
coming by and checking out what I like what I do the the videos watch my videos and stuff like that I really do appreciate it and I really do appreciate all the things you guys do whether it's subscribe subscribing or it's liking the video or it's commenting anything anything you guys do I do appreciate it I do want to let you guys know that I I do thank you very much um and then on to the next shoe so these pairs of shoes are actually not new per se okay they're actually not new so it's an interesting story with these shoes all right but these are the shoes that i did get the kind of like the the laker colored expired delta ones i remember i do have these in my collection that i'm going to show off and i the only reason why i'm showing these off is because i am recently able to wear them so a couple things uh some things happen to where uh uh some family issues some not family issues but some family things happen to where now uh, I was able to grab these shoes from my older house in California. Uh -uh. So these shoes are the Delta Ones, the basically the Laker colored Delta, Delta Ones. These shoes I've had for a very long time, ever since, um, ever since, ever since high school actually. Ever since the beginning of high school, I believe freshman year, probably sophomore year, sophomore year of high school, I've had these shoes. I just never was able to wear them because I wasn't, I, I couldn't grow into them. They're ten, they're ten and a half, so that's why. But now I can, so I. That's the interesting story. I've had these for so long. I've had these for so long, and I just now realized, like, wait, I can actually wear these now. So I can actually put these in my in my in my my log of shoes that i can actually wear and i like them i i personally like them i like them they look very nice to me in my in my personal opinion uh the purple and yellow with with um nike i like it i like them a lot so these are the delta ones and my last pairs of shoes are shoes that i was looking at originally at actually uh at my job at the mall uh i was looking at i was looking at foot locker shoes i was looking at foot locker and stuff like that uh, i found these at finish line but they did not have my size unfortunately but now that they do, I definitely decided to grab them. I 100% was going to grab them and, and put them in my uh, shoe collection. But I got some Jordan ones, so these are the colorways for the Jordan ones. It's the it's a tan with the with the red and black checkered, uh, not checkered, but like flannel type of style. So these I was I would definitely am 100% excited to get. I I love these as soon as I saw them, and. These are kind of like the shoes that actually, or not these, but um, there are some shoes like, I, I, when I got these, I kind of realized that I was kind of a sneakerhead. I, I, when I got these shoes, this is when I realized it because right after, if you guys don't know, they are making um, Spider-Man uh, across the Spider-Verse shoes, some Jordan ones for those. And I really like how those look and I'm probably gonna get those. I'm 100% gonna try to get those. Um, if I'm able to, not prob I'm, I may not be. I'm, I'm not that lucky when it comes to things because they're gonna be. Who knows? Probably gonna be sold out by the time I do be able to get some. But I'm gonna try to get those. But these are the Do Jordan ones. These are probably. These are actually my first Jordan ones in my collection. These are my first Jordan ones in my collection, and uh, I'm going to 100% get more because they're comfortable. They look nice. Uh, I gotta get. I want to get. Uh, I want to get some blue ones. I need. That's probably the next ones on my list. Probably some blue Jordan ones. So if you guys do have any Jordan ones that are blue, that are that that look good, please put them in the comment section down below and like put the name in it in the comment section down below and let me know because then I would I would 100% enjoy looking at it and see if I if, if they fit my style and stuff like that. So with that being said, that's going to be the end of the video. So if you guys could leave a like, please um and subscribe, like and subscribe, subscribe because it tells me what kind of content you guys want to see and comment as well as a good comment on your comment better yet comment on your favorite shoe down to below. What is your favorite shoe in your collection or favorite shoe in general? that you guys do like to see or like to wear and stuff like that so with that being said this is drace regulus and i am the king of the dragons and i am out you guys see you guys later and happy holidays